guys welcome back to auto repair guys thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel if you guys have a link in guys any link in such as mkx mks mkz mkt guys and others as well and you guys get any of those three codes guys okay you can see the codes right here in the corner of the video guys one of them is p0122 the other one is p0223 and the third one is p2110 guys that with us will explain what what uh, could cause each one of those codes all of the three codes guys lead to one thing okay you may get just one you may get two you may get three of them so we'll explain now how to how to know what to fix guys quick introduction we have more than 200 videos on this car and every car we get at the shop because our mission is to save you guys as much money as we can so please subscribe to the channel like the video guys leave a comment below let us know if the video was helpful or if you have any questions so let's start on it now so we'll be working here on Lincoln MKX guys, this is the scanner that we're using, you can find it guys, we'll have the link in the description of the video below. Uh, I'll go ahead, plug it in guys, you may experience the car not having enough power, okay, not running correctly, uh, not, uh, uh, okay, just being able to go to certain miles per hour, let's say you cannot go more than 30 miles per hour, it's not safe at all guys, it may misfire, it can sound really really bad, okay, I'll turn. Let me grab the key quick and I'm going to turn the ignition on and show you how we'll fix that now. So, let me show you now guys. Okay, I'll turn the ignition on. We have that little bitty scanner guys, it's very cheap but it does amazing, it's amazing too for basic diagnostics and you can check it out guys in the description of the video below. Now, it's communicating, it will take just a little bit of time and it will give us all the different things here. We have three codes now. As I said, you may just have one of them, it really depends how it fails. And if you have three of them, we'll explain what else it could be. Read codes, stored codes, okay, and the codes that we have. Okay, right here now, guys. P, 0, 1, 2, 2, throttle pedal, position sensor, switch A. Next code is P, 0, 2, 2, 3, throttle pedal, position sensor, switch B. And number three, throttle actuator control system force limited RPM. So, I'll go ahead, turn the ignition off, and I'll show you guys what causes that now. So, if you guys open the hood of your Lincoln, guys, we have a 3.5, if you have a 3.7 engine, the procedure should be the same. Now, this is your air filter box, mass airflow sensor, the intake boot leads to the throttle body, guys. Okay, this thing right here, this is called your throttle body. This is guys what could activate these codes. Uh, if it goes bad, you will get one of these codes. Sometimes guys, if the wiring harness is loose, you, you may get a code or I'll recommend to remove the wire, clean it a little bit, reinsert it and see if that fixes the problem. In our case guys, we'll have to replace our uh, throttle body. It's short guys and if you need any of the tools or parts, we'll have it in the description of the video below. If you want to see the replacement video, it will be on the channel. If you want to replace it guys and you want to see the video, we have the video on our channel so just search uh, throttle body replacement on Lincoln MKX and Ford Edge is the same way because they use the same engines, many Ford Lincoln vehicles uh, share the same engines. We'll go ahead and replace ours now and see if that fixes the problem so you know guys what you need to fix. So we'll go ahead, put, it, put the new one and we'll see if that takes care of the problem now. So we're putting it together now. In the meantime guys, okay, we're just putting the cover now, we replaced our thing, I'll go ahead turn the ignition on, okay, ignition on, and now I'll go back, and we'll click, okay, right here now, erase codes, erase, done, okay, I'll go back, okay, what I'm going to do now, we'll click read codes to make sure that we don't have any stored codes, Perfect. I'll turn the ignition off, pull the key out, turn it again, start it. Okay, there is no engine light. Let's see if it runs good. Oh yeah. So that new throttle body definitely fixed our problem. Thank you for watching guys. Please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time.